Mark Keynes is the sexiest man alive. I agree. What up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Mark Into Cable. Mark Keynes doing stuff. And tonight it is Thursday, late night, and I am at Bally's Hotel and Casino, Atlantic City. And uh, for those of you who don't know, Atlantic City, New Jersey is kind of like a mini Las Vegas, but um, a lot smaller and a lot um, not as good. But uh, it's still a nice little getaway if you're ever in the area and you want to do something. They got the casino down there. They got all the slot machines, table games, anything that you might be into. I did notice that the, um, I think the slot machines might be a little tight here because, you know, they uh, they weren't really very um, generous with me winning. I know you already have a bad chance at winning on slot machines, but I think here might be even worse than, uh, than normal. But I'd like to just uh, show you around the room a little bit here real quick. All right, so this is what the junior suite looks like here at Bally's in Atlantic City. Don't mind the mess. I have uh, some stuff thrown around, but um, this is the ocean view. So as you can see, can't really see too well, but yeah, there's the beach, the boardwalk out there. So, pretty decent view here. Uh, pretty good size room. Here's the bathroom. I got some stuff thrown around, but there's a nice shower here and uh, this big tub, which is very relaxing and nice view out here from the bathroom. You can see the beach there at nighttime. So, little pros and cons of this place. Um, as I mentioned, right behind me here is the uh, the boardwalk and the beach. And uh, the pros of that are the beach is it's a, one of the only free beaches in New Jersey. So you don't have to pay to get on the beach in Atlantic City. So those of you who are from other states, other areas. New Jersey, normally you have to pay to get on every beach here. Um, but this one is one of the few that is free. But um, you might find that it's not quite as clean as some of the other beaches where you have to pay because sometimes you might be paying for that um, cleanliness that comes at the beach. And so you would imagine, as you would imagine, there's a lot of... Uh, drugs, some sketchy characters out here. Um, I just got in from having a late night snack out on the boardwalk. I found a, a place that had like chicken kebabs and uh, the boardwalk is kind of, kind of scary at night. Like if you're not a big um, scary man like me, you might not want to go out on the boardwalk when it comes to that nighttime in Atlantic City. I was uh, sitting at a table by myself eating some chicken kebabs and uh, you know there's a lot of beggars out there trying to get your your money and stuff some woman comes up to me and she's like uh, starts asking me for money saying that she's really hungry and I'm like I said to her well actually you know I might not eat this whole thing why don't you sit down and uh, and share this you know, you can have one of these chicken kebabs, you know, I'll share it. I'll share my food with you. And, and the lady starts screaming at me. <laughs> like she, she starts yelling at me about that. Like it was some like awful thing that I said to her. And I'm like, well, if you're hungry, you said you're hungry and I'm offering to give you food here. So, you know, I, if I was hungry and somebody offered me food, I would eat it. You know, I wouldn't, but she just wanted money, obviously. And then last night, as I was driving through here, um, I pulled up, well, I, I drove past, there was like a ambulance stopped and uh, 
somebody was laying on the sidewalk like and they were unresponsive so I think it was some kind of overdose situation so yeah if you make your way to the um, the the residential area of Atlantic City and like the boardwalk it's uh it's not like the safest place and it's kind of dirty kind of sketchy stuff like that but all in all um, for me I live in New Jersey so it's convenient just to run down here if I want like a quick getaway or something you know you don't have to fly um, you know Vegas is like a five-hour flight for me whereas Atlantic City is like a one-hour drive so um, if I'm in the mood for like chilling at a pool during the day in the summer being at the beach um, going at the casino playing some games or something you know Atlantic City is a good option for me and uh, a lot of the casinos are pretty generous with the rooms throughout the week um, as far as like if you're a gambler or something they'll uh, m they're more than willing to give you you know comped rooms throughout the week because uh, not many people come here there's always available rooms they're trying to get people to come here and um, they figure you're gonna lose all your money in the casino anyways so they'll give you the room for free so um, definitely something to check out if that's something you're interested in, you got a chance to see the room, a little bit of the casino. I try not to film too much inside the casino because I don't think they really want you to be filming in the casino. But yeah, just remember if you're ever in Atlantic City, be careful out there um, and have fun. And uh, don't expect to, to win a whole lot of money here because I think that they like turn the machines down so that they don't pay out too much but other than that you know just wanted to let you know what I was up to um, I've been here the past couple of nights chilling in Atlantic City and uh, been trying to hit up the beach you know as much as possible because it is officially summertime and coming up on the 4th of July so everybody make sure you like and subscribe to the channel just got this thing uh, monetized, and um, so if you're seeing ads before the videos, I apologize, but that's how YouTubers make money. And so far, I've made nine cents on my YouTube channel, so look out, because a new stream of income is coming through. But until next time, thanks for being here. I love you guys.